You're watching BBN Tonight on your official UK sports station, LEX 18. Presented by Central Bank, the official bank of UK athletics. Hello, everybody. This is Jack Gibbons calling on the Big Blue Nation to donate to the Kentucky flood relief. Thousands of Kentuckians need our help right now. So don't wait. Donate today. Our guy, Jack Goose Givens of the UK Sports Network, makes his own appeal to the BBN during the telethon that was organized by LEX18 and the American Red Cross. To donate to the Kentucky flood relief effort, call 855-999-GIVE. Visit lex18.com slash kyfloodrelief or mail a check to the American Red Cross on Newtown Pike. Well, the Kentucky men's basketball regular season also wrapping up tomorrow with a matchup against South Carolina. Yeah, to get us ready for that game and the future of UK basketball, I talked to assistant coach Joel Justice in a conversation that is sponsored by Bird, the official shared mobility partner of the University of Kentucky. Well, Joel, the other night after uh, the loss with Ole Miss, coach just talked about kind of sometimes the team reverting. When you're seeing the team revert, what are some of the things that you're seeing out of this team? I think, you know, the, the biggest thing that we've talked about, you know, with, with young people is, is the consistency of, of effort. Uh, and, and it's taken this team a little bit of a time to, to find it. And I think that we have in games. Uh, I think that we have um, throughout games. Uh, and then our biggest thing is looking for that consistency throughout 40 minutes. Uh, that's something that, you know, we have to just continue to try to work at. Um, you know, basketball is a tournament sport. It's uh, one that you, you've got to be playing your best at the end of the season. I know that we're not typically in this position where the tournament play is something that you rely on, like most of college basketball does. But uh, the, the situation that we're in right now, we have to be playing our best in March uh, to get to continue to play in March. So uh, our biggest thing is, is just focusing on, on the game on Saturday and then uh, see, see what comes after that. So we get into March usually. It seems like there's always a little tweak here or there. Can, is, can there be a tweak or are you working on a tweak that, that we could see in this final game heading into the SEC tournament? Well, I think Cal has, you know, been tweaking all year, you know, really with this, with this group. And, and I think that that has been the, something that has been the most difficult, the most challenging uh, is, is we've just been trying to, to see what works. And, and and really, the, the past year has been a tweak, <laughs> you know, from, from when the, the season was, was over almost a, a year ago. We've really had to change how we do everything, you know, from recruiting to summer workouts to, to the fall to the beginning of practice to, to our schedule. And uh, it's been a, cons you know, a, a consistent, constant tweak, uh, I guess you might, might say. And so I think our guys are, are extremely motivated to, to have a great march. To, to get better in practice every single day. They're putting in the extra time. And, and for us, uh, that, it, that keeps you goal. That keeps you excited is, is when your players are, are still focused. They're still uh, lasered in in terms of, of being their better version. Uh, we've got to continue to be our best version as coaches. When you talk about the South Carolina team, a couple of big guards, uh, A.J. Lawson at 6'6", at six, six, and Jermaine Cousinard at 6'4", uh, th that's some, some tall timber when you're talking about guards. Yeah, they've got a great team. They've always played hard down there. It's always a, a game that is difficult because uh, you talk about a team that, that does fight. You talk about a team that is physical. Uh, so you've got to be strong with the ball. You've got to be aggressive. Uh, you've kind of got to fight fire with fire. Uh, you've got to be aggressive. You can't be on your heels. Uh, they're a team that always kind of preys on that. So for us, uh, I think this week we've you know really just been – dialed in with our guys of getting them confident being aggressive and you've got to go attack the other night jimmy dyke said something that was interesting to me at least and i know you can't mention names but he said you might have an eight man nine man class next year that kind of took me uh, by surprise a little bit could you see that happening uh going forward i mean i i think that you know for for us uh, i think that we're always um, you know, here for our players, you know, we're going to be about uh, providing an opportunity for young people to come here, chase their dreams on, on the biggest stage under the, you know, the brightest lights, uh, playing for the best fans in the country. Um, and, and whether that's a, a one person class, whether that's a two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, however many it is, you know, 
this is a great place to come and play college basketball. And, and I believe here is, is, is there's no better place in the world to come, uh, you know, with a world-class university that, that we have here with Dr. Cavaluto to an athletic department that, you know, Mr. Barnhart has built. Um, you see that, that this is an incredible place to come. Uh, it's an incredible place to stay as well. And I think that you've seen uh, guys come here and, and do it in one year. I think you've seen guys come here and, and do it in two years and uh, even been here for three and four. And, and I think that you've seen over 20 guys graduate uh, under Coach Calipari uh, during his time here. Uh, and you've seen guys be the number one pick after one and done. So uh, this is a place that, that is special, special to, to us as coaches. And I know how special it is to, to the guys that have played here as well to, to the entire state of Kentucky and, and the Big Blue Nation. Joel Justice, thanks so much. Good luck against South Carolina and as you move on to the SEC tournament. Thanks so much. Go Cats. And we'll be getting you ready for the postseason with a special edition of BBN Game Day. Our SEC tournament preview show will air in place of BBN tonight, Monday at 7.30 on LEX 18. Check out UKAthletics.com for air times outside of Lexington. We'll have more on the flood relief efforts in our next segment on BBN Tonight.